learning and GI leave is really convenient and it helps me keep up to date with uh, the, the new standards of endoscopic practice. E-learning and GI leave has really um, benefited uh, my learning because it really supplements stuff that I'm seeing and I'm able to get repetition with certain types of images. So my favorite thing about GI leave is being able to learn on the go because I use my mobile device to access, for example, GSAP questions, which um, I think highlight what I don't know and they're pretty broad and very helpful um, in that way. I would say what I find um, to be really helpful and beneficial about GI Leap would be um, the ability to have a really interactive way of learning. There's um, a lot of like activity and, and the way it's set up, you're able to um, click on different topics and kind of go exactly to whichever area you'd really um, like to work on. Um, and then I also find that um, being able to access it from anywhere is really helpful um, because we do practice at multiple different sites. You know, GSAP is based on cases, which are so applicable because that's what we deal with in our day-to-day -day doctoring lives, our patients and cases. And the nice thing is that it gives you a lot of data from different images, radiology, pathology. Um, so it's truly how patients present. What I find really helpful about GSAP is I think um, we uh, have to learn so much information as GI fellows and the best way that I'm able to actually retain and um, and really remember everything is by doing questions and trying to apply that knowledge. And so GSAP gives a really good opportunity to try and learn in a very active way, which helps really solidify the material and helps you remember the material. Mm -hmm.